We all know the story of the golden egg, the goose and the golden egg and the farmer. The farmer who enjoyed the golden egg was also a greedy man. He turned out to be a greedy person. As a result, when you are greedy, you lose everything. And that's the short story that we are going to do. A story, and then I give you questions, you find the answer from the story. So the moral is, never be greedy. You lose even what you have. Now, once a farmer, once a farmer had a goose, a farmer, once a farmer had a goose, okay, now it was a strange goose, now it was a strange goose. It laid a golden egg every day. It laid, it laid a golden egg It laid a golden egg every day. Once a farmer had a goose, now it was a strange goose. It laid a golden egg every day. Soon the farmer, soon the farmer became, soon the farmer became rich by selling by selling the golden egg golden egg then but he was greedy but he was greedy. He said to himself, he said to himself, I now get, I now get only one, only one golden egg. I now get only one golden egg every day. Why? Why should I not have? Why should I not have all the eggs? All the eggs at once. I will, I will kill the goose, kill the goose. I will kill the goose and take, and take all the eggs, all the eggs. out of it. So the farmer killed the goose. Okay? So, the 
the farmer. So the farmer killed the goose. Then he cut it open to get all the eggs out. Then he cut it open to get to get all the eggs out of it. And what did the farmer find? What did the farmer What did the farmer find? He found no egg. He found no egg. No eggs in it. It was, it was just like any other goose. The farmer was very sad. The farmer was very sad. He did not, he did not get now even one golden egg a day. So we have the story here, the farmer and the golden, golden lake, egg laying goose. Once a farmer had a goose, now it was a strange goose. It laid a golden egg every day. Soon the farmer became rich by selling the golden egg. But he was greedy. He said to himself, I, can, I now get only one golden egg every day. Why should I not have all the eggs at once? I will kill the goose take all the eggs out of it. So the farmer killed the goose. Then he cut it open to get all the egg out of it. And what did the farmer find? He found no eggs in it. It was just like any other goose. The farmer was very sad. He did not get now even one golden egg a day. So, you have the story. Now, I will give you some questions for you to find out. Questions. First question. What kind of goose had the farmer? What kind? What kind of goose? had the farmer. So, what will be the answer? The farmer had a goose, the farmer had a goose that laid a golden egg every day. The farmer had a goose that laid golden egg. Next question. 
What kind of egg did the goose lay? What kind? What kind of egg? What kind of egg did the goose lay? Then you will say, lay became laid. You will say, the goose laid a golden egg every day. The goose lay, you will write laid. The goose laid a golden egg every day. Next question. Was the farmer greedy? Was the farmer greedy? What will you say? Yes, the farmer was greedy. Yes, the farmer, you have to add here, was greedy. Next, what did the farmer say to himself? What did? What did the farmer say to himself? What did the farmer say to himself? He said, I now get only one egg every day. Why should I not have all the eggs at once? I will kill the goose and take all the eggs out of it. What did the farmer say to himself? He said to himself, I will kill the goose and take all the eggs out of it. One sentence if you write it enough. What did the farmer say to himself? I will kill the goose and take all the eggs out of it. Next question. Why did he kill the goose? Fifth one. Why? Why did? He killed the goose. Why did he kill? He killed the goose to get all the golden eggs. He wanted to get all the golden eggs at once. Then, did he get the golden eggs? He didn't even get one egg. Now, was the farmer happy now? No, farmer was very sad. Why was the farmer sad? He was sad because he did not get even one golden egg a day. Because of his greed, he lost it. So, this understand the passage or the story, look at the question, get the answer from the. But whenever you have things like this, lay, late, you have to change a little bit of your grammar when you answer the question, like this one. What did the farmer say to himself? The farmer said to himself, I want all the golden egg. What did he kill? Why did he kill the goose? He killed the goose to get all the golden egg at once. That is comprehension. Some of us may know about the story of a foolish goat. Now here, there was a fox and a goat. The fox accidentally fell into the well. And then he was calling out for help. No one came. Then a goat comes along. And actually it's a foolish goat. The fox says, come, what green grass? Yeah, I am enjoying myself. So he foolishly goes in. The, uh, the fox climbs on the goat and comes out. Foolishness. So we are doing a short comprehension on this little story of the fox and the goat. I will give you the little passage, then you, I will give you questions for you to find out for yourself. Comprehend the story, get the answers. Okay. While reaching down, while reaching, while reaching down to drink, to drink, While reaching down to drink the water in a well, the water in a well, the 
one day a fox fell in one day a fox fell in okay while reaching down to drink the water in a well one day a fox fell in try as try as he could he would try as he would he could not get he could not get out get out again because because the walls of the well the walls of the well the walls of the well were too high were too high then not long after not long after not long after a goat came along goat came along seeing the fox down there seeing the fox down down there he asked him the reason why he asked him asked him the reason why i am enjoying i am i am enjoying i'm enjoying the cool the cool pure enjoying the cool pure water replied the fox replied the fox wouldn't you like to jump down and taste it wouldn't you wouldn't you like to like to jump down and taste it wouldn't you like to jump down and taste it without stopping to think without without stopping without stopping to think without stopping to think the foolish goat the foolish goat jumped down
no sooner no sooner had he reached the bottom no sooner had he reached the bottom than the cunning to his back and scrambled up scrambled up scrambled to the top looking down now at the unhappy goat looking looking down at the down at the unhappy goat the fox laughed and said unhappy goat the fox laughed and said next time next time friend friend goat be sure be sure to look before to look before you leap and that's the story of the goat and the fox now you have some questions let's look at the read the comprehension before we do the questions okay now it's a beautiful little story while reaching down to drink the water in a well one day the fox fell in try as he would he could not get out again because the walls of the well were too high not long after a goat came along seeing the fox down there he asked him the reason why i am enjoying the cool pure water replied the fox wouldn't you like to jump down and taste it without stopping to think the foolish goat jumped down no sooner had he reached the bottom than the cunning old fox leaped on to his back and scrambled to the top looking down at the unhappy goat the fox laughed and said next time friend goat be sure to look before you leap now what happened to the fox while he was trying to drink water what happened what happened to the fox what happened to the fox while he tried to drink water while he tried to drink okay what happened to the fox while he try to drink some water answer reaching down to drink some water in a well one day the fox fell in so 
what happened to the fox while he tried to drink some water while he tried to drink some water he fell into the well why could he not get out of the well why why could he not get out not get out of the well why could he not get out of the well he could not get out of the well because the walls of the well were too high he could not get out of the well because the walls of the well were too high next one what did the goat ask the fox what did what did the goat ask the fox okay what did the goat ask the now he asked the goat asked the goat came along seeing the fox down the he asked him what is your reason what is the reason that you are there down there in the well next one what was the answer given by the fox the fox said i am enjoying the cool fresh water so the fourth question is what was the answer given by the fox what was what was the answer given by the by the fox what are the answer the fox said i am enjoying the cool pure water then you can go on you can have more question what did the goat do after listening to the fox without thinking he jumped in what did the fox do when the goat jumped in when the goat jumped in he quickly leapt onto his back and scrambled to the top of the well and he went away okay what did he tell his friend goat what lesson did the goat learn he said friend goat be sure to look before you leap that mean don't do things don't believe people first think use your brain and then take action so this is a small comprehension let's look at it once again while reaching down to drink the water in the well one day the fox fell in try as he would he could not get out again because the walls of the well were too high not long after a goat came along who came along a goat came along seeing the fox down there he asked him the reason why so what did he ask the fox hey why are you there down the well what did he answer i am enjoying the cool pure water replied the fox wouldn't you like to come down and taste it so the fox is requesting the goat to come and taste it without stopping to think the foolish goat jumped down no sooner had he reached the bottom than the cunning old fox leapt leapt on to his back and scrambled to the top looking down at the unhappy goat the fox laughed and said next time friend goat be sure to look before you leave question what happened to the fox while he tried to drink some water while he tried to reaching down to drink some water in a well he fell the fox fell in why couldn't he get out of the well he could not get out of the well because the walls of the well were too high what did the goat ask the fox yes the fox the reason why he was at the bottom of the well 
What was the answer given by the fox? The fox said, wouldn't you like to taste it? I am enjoying pure, pure, cool water. Now, what, was, what, did the, what did the cunning fox tell the goat friend? He said, goat friend, next time, be sure to look before you leave. Don't jump in because people tell you. This is a short comprehension. It's lovely to read, understand and answer the questions.